where President Mohamed Buhari has applauded the commitment of Nigerians and diaspora to Nigeria's development. The president is also optimistic that their contributions will have a considerable impact on Nigeria and her economy. The commander-in-chief, who was represented, made this remark at the 2022 celebration of Nigerians and Diaspora Day in Abuja. We will tell us our details and we'll return with business news. 25th July has been designated by the federal government as a day to celebrate and honor Nigerians in diaspora. This was deemed necessary following the contributions over the years of the over 17 million Nigerians in diaspora in financial, economic and skills development to the country. It's not about uh, jamboree. This is not what this is about. This is about intellectual discussion, about celebrating the achievements of Nigeria, about seeing them. I mean, somebody is coming from Kazakhstan. We have them from all over Vietnam, Japan, China, all here in this, all Europe and all that. So it's really about that intellectual discussion. You heard those who have said here that it's our biggest expert, it's our biggest talent. Nidcom has provided a platform that helps in the exchange of skills and knowledge acquisition. And this has also helped in the realization of many success stories. Professor Ibrahim Gambari, who speaks on behalf of the president, appreciates Nigerians and diaspora for keeping faith in Nigeria. The willingness of my administration to support NICOM in fulfilling its mandate holistically through consideration for the establishment of the Nigerian Diaspora Investment Trust Fund, NDRTF, as well as the Diaspora Intervention Fund to support the activities of NITCOM's engagement with Nigerians in the diaspora. Now is the time to rally around and challenge ourselves to challenge and to salvage our country and its people by collaborating with government to mobilize resources, both human and material, to mitigate the anticipated debilitating effects on our nation. While Nigeria celebrates the over $20 billion remittance by Nigerians in diaspora, Bamidele Ademola Olateju believes there is more that could be harnessed. We are not doing enough to harness the power of remittances. For example, we just the money is sent to individuals, nothing else is done. People use it to buy uh, clothing, pay school fees, do all sorts of things. Other speakers allude to the great contributions and strides Nigerians outside the country are making. As part of his final message to Nigerians and diaspora, President Buhari assures of a steady democracy through a free, fair and credible elections in 2023. Moya Thomas, TVC News, Abuja.